Don't forget to like, subscribe and share the videos. Hello friends, welcome to Ganesh IAS Academy. This is the new session conducted by the Ganesh IAS Academy. It's purely for the upcoming mains exam. Here what we are going to do is, we are going to discuss about the previous year mains UPC questions. Let's go with the previous year question 2023. It's a 10 more question. It's about the economy. The faster economic growth requires increased share of manufacturing sector in GDP, particularly of MSME, particularly of MSME. Comment on the present policies of the government in this regard. So it is a 150 words question and a 10 mark. Okay. So it is of a 10 mark question. When you come to this question, first you need to have a clear understanding about this question. Okay. First, the jargon here is or the keyword is it's a command. So you need to know what is the meaning of the command. So there are many words like critically examine, critically evaluate, give your opinion. There are lot of words. Based on that key terms, the answer will be vary. So here they used a word called as comment, which means just as that of a cricket commentary. In a cricket commentary, what they will do? They will say that these are the things happening. This player is going doing good. It's better to do that. So uh, use a swing ball. So these are the certain commentary the cricket will cricket uh, while the cricket match is happening the commentary will do. Okay. So such a way this answer is about a command the present policy which means what are the issues in the present policies? What are the things you can do? So these things is about this question. Before that there are certain things called as foster economic growth requires increased share of manufacturing sector in GDP, particularly of MSME. So, first thing about this question is you need a data. So, what the data means? How much the agriculture sector is contributing to the GDP? Next, how much the manufacturing sector is contributing to the GDP? Next is how much the services sector is contributing to the GDP. This is the first data you need to know to address this question. Next, second data is how much this MSME is going to contribute to the GDP. This is the second most important data you need to know if you are going to address this question. Next. Okay, so faster economic growth requires increased share of manufacturing sector. So, if the India need, India GDP needs to grow in a faster manner, the growth rate of 8 percentage, 10 percentage or 12 percentage means it is a faster growth. So, if the growth rate is that much faster means what the question is saying is increased share of manufacturing sector. So, if the increased share of manufacturing sector means it will lead to the faster economic growth, that is the question is saying. So, you need to enhance it. You need to give certain reasons why the question is saying like this. So, whether here they, the question itself said that the faster economic growth requires the increased manufacturing sector activity, which means so you can't say that it won't be. Because the question itself is saying like this. So you have to accept it and you have to give the add on points to that first, to that question. Okay. So to that terms. So first thing is about the data. Next is you need a reasons. Why the manufacturing sector is, if the share of manufacturing sector is increased means how the how it will lead to the faster economic growth. That is the second thing you need to know and you have to give an answer. So, second is reasons and the third part of this question is command the present policies of the government in this regard. So, third thing you need to know, you need to give answer to this question is third thing is policies related to 
எம்எஸ்எம்இ மேபி ஃபோர் டு ஃபைவ் பாலிசிஸ் தட் யூ நீட் டு நோ அண்ட் யூ ஹாவ் டு கிவ் இட் இஸ் அன்சர் ஹியர் ஓகே ஸோ தட் இஸ் தனதர் திங் ஓகே அண்ட் ஃபோர்த் திங் இஸ் யூ நீட் டு கிவ் அ கமெண்ட் கமெண்ட் மீன்ஸ் வெதர் திஸ் பாலிசிஸ் giving a output or not if there is no output means why the issue with this policy what are the issues with this policy okay so there are many policies related to msme recently they even changed the msme definitions and also there is make in india program startup india program ramp program so there are lot of policies related to the msme so here it is about command whether this policy is giving the output or not if the if there is no output means what are the issues with this policies that is about the command so for this 10 mark question you need this much thing but it is not a tougher one it is one of the easiest thing you can easily answer this question okay let's discuss the answer also so these are the things you need to give so first data so contribution from the manufacturing sector is around 23 percentage of gdp in which 8 percentage of gdp from msme so these are the data you need to give either in the introduction or anything so first thing is about this data so this will be the introduction okay next sub heading as faster economic growth requires increased share of manufacturing sector means the reason for increasing the manufacturing sector activities is two first the reason is it will act as a bridge between primary sector and the tertiary sector because in the primary sector we are producing the raw materials okay either through the mining or through the agriculture activities or through the fisheries we are we are producing certain raw materials that raw materials need to be transformed into a product so if you are going to transform this into a product means that is going to increases the industrial activities or your manufacturing activities so that will increases the employment so here the primary sector and the tertiary sector should be bridged with the secondary sector so this bridging activities is going to happen means that will increases the what to say there is a demand for a product means obviously there will be increases in the production process also because the farmer will go in for going to the production also increase try to increase their production so that is going to benefit them also so obviously the gdp contribution from the agriculture sector also going to increase and also that is going to directly or indirectly increases the tertiary sector activity also so that so in that way the faster economic growth will happens due to the increased share of manufacturing sector this is the one of the point. next increases the employment so if you if there is a uh, if there is a need for a growth in the service sector means definitely it need to be skilled so skilled labor only be able to work in this tertiary sector so in that scenario if it is a manufacturing sector means with the limited skill they can able to incorporated or they can be get into this manufacturing sector so it will going to increase as the employment activity third it will increase as the export fourth it will reduce as the import so by this way it is going to get a faster economic growth it is a easy way of answering the question so before that you can use use it like this in every corner you can use it if you have a four points if you have a Six point means you will go with the hexagon because it's a ten mark question, so it is better to just list down the points. 
just list down the points there is no need for you explain the points because it's just a 10 more question so you just give the reasons if you have a six point means you can go with the hexagon if you have a four five point means you would just go with the pentagon or something pentagon shape or anything <coughs> okay so next is particularly the msme sector so msme is means there will be increases in the lot of entrepreneurship opportunities so it will it will increase the economic activities and also it will reduce the inequality in the society so if there is a small and marginal enterprise is going to have going to grow grow means that will reduce the inequality in the society so that is also the most important thing so these are the things now you have to go for a command so command means there is two way of answering first you can take any one policy and you can command it like what is make in india program and then you just command that these are the issues with this make in india program or else there is a export promotion for the msme sector you just give the export promotion uh, the export uh, related to the export promotion you just give a one or two points one or two lines of answer after this you, you just command it so this is the one way of answering or else you just list the all the programs like make in india program second msme act third production linked incentives schemes and then fourth ramp program and then fifth you can list the start up india program so you just list the points afterwards you give a command as a holistic manner this is also one way of answer it's better to go with this method because it is a easy one okay then you just comment it command means it's like a both the thing what are the issues at the same time what are the benefits it are doing so when it comes to the command point means when it comes to this all the schemes are only helping the uh, it, it is not helping the small and marginal enterprises it is only helping the larger enterprises so there is a issue or inequality among the distribution of the fund towards the industries that is the first point you can give okay so you can simply say it as neglecting the SME. This is the first concern. Okay. Second is obviously the bureaucratic hurdles and delay. Okay. So the issue with the bureaucratic hurdles that is the most important issue. And third is getting a power supply. or else power fluctuation issue power fluctuation issues and also getting a licensing so these are the major issues still affecting the msme sector and also when it comes to the export promotion scheme after the export is reached the destination after the payment is done then only you can get the money back so these are the major issues so this this is the way of answering the question so i am not going to give a this is the only answer uh, what i am saying is uh, you there are lot of answer but this is the structure you need to follow okay so that is the more important thing or else uh, there are another issues yes inadequate infrastructures still most of the region have a, uh, most of the regions of india is not having any transportation facility either a roadway or railway 
so that is the one of the major concern and also still most of the roads are not connected to the ports that is also the issue so these are the these are the major issues that is affecting the manufacturing sector and it is affecting the msme sector and the another issue is unskilled labor this is also the major issue and then most of the sectors most of the indian peoples are rest with the informal sectors they are not ready to do any business activities or they are not going to do any entrepreneurship activities they are just to go with the informal activities so there is a huge chunk of people in the informal sector so these are the issues with the policies this policy is not addressing these concerns so this is the command so in the conclusion you can say that the government need to address this means they can easily achieve the this much trillion of economy within this year so there are a lot of targets you can you can quote that and also it will reduce the unemployment rate according to the ilo ilo report there are india have the this much of unemployment we can easily address this thing by addressing this msme sector this is the way forward answer this is the way you have to conclude the answer okay so just i am giving the structure for the question so how to answer question you try to incorporate this thing in your answer and you make an answer and put a comment of your answer okay thank you